Welcome to day two here at Pfizer Forum. We are live from the RNC, and we begin today at five with breaking news. A man is shot and killed by police just a mile and a half away from us here at Pfizer Forum. And we have learned the officers involved are from Ohio, Columbus Police Department to be more specific. That shooting happened near 14th and Belief. Fox 6's Stephanie Quirk is live near the scene. She's been there all afternoon with the latest. Stephanie, get us up to speed. Yeah, well, we're still waiting for a press conference right now with Milwaukee police, but, uh, you know, community members and family members who uh, say they knew the, the victim, the man who was shot, just held a very powerful press conference here. I'm going to step out of the way so you can see there's still tape up here um, at the scene near 17th and Valite. Uh, we've learned from the street angels and family members the man shot was homeless and lived in this neighborhood. Uh, his name was Samuel Sharp and his family says he was in his 40s. We've learned Milwaukee police are handling the investigation and the U.S. Secret Service is playing some role. Uh, over the course of the past few hours, we've seen multiple unmarked, uh, excuse me, unmarked squad cars entering and leaving the area as police investigate. Uh, take a listen to what the cousin of the victim had to say uh, just a few minutes ago. And stop killing people's families. Today, y'all came to his neighborhood. He got a dog right there. He loved people. He loved animals. Y'all came and shot him down right here with his own people. And again, we are still waiting on a press conference with Milwaukee police. We've learned from community members and family here. Uh, they're planning to hold a vigil tonight at 8 o'clock uh, in honor of Sharp, who was the man shot. Uh, we'll keep you posted, of course, as we learn more here from 17th and Bleed. But for now, reporting live in Milwaukee, Stephanie Quirk, Fox 6 News. Stephanie, I have a question for you. We see other officers in the background. These officers involved were for Columbus patrolling the scene right now is it a collection of milwaukee only officers or are you seeing other out-of-town agencies involved in securing the perimeter you know from what we can see here is milwaukee police officers here but again there was at least a dozen of unmarked uh, squad cars coming in and out of the scene here. Uh, so it very well could be that there's multiple agencies investigating this. We also learned that the U.S. Secret Service is playing a role uh, in this investigation. Of course, when we learn more during the past conference with police, we'll keep you updated.